GNOME's task switcher is pretty bare bones. All you get to see is just the icons and you navigate around them to reach the window of your choice. Sure, it is performance efficient, but not all users like things as simple as it is. Some users want to customize the look and feel of their desktop environment, including GNOME's task switching experience. This is Ankush from its first and here I am going to highlight three ways with which you can customize the task switcher. For every method, we will be utilizing a GNOME extension. So first we need to install the GNOME extension manager. You can get it from Flathub. The extension manager will help us easily and reliably install and manage the extensions. Fret not, even if you are a new Linux user, the extension manager will help you do what you are set out to do. The first extension is the all-time popular Coverflow. Head to the extension manager, search for Coverflow under browse section and hit install or check the page before you hit install. With Coverflow, you can replace the icon style task switcher with cards or covers. It is not animation heavy, so you can totally use it if you like it. It's kind of like Windows 7 Aero Flip 3D effect if you remember that. Once you install it, the extension gets active automatically. If not, you can always find the toggle for it under installed list in the extension manager. You can customize the experience using the Coverflow extension settings. For starters, you can choose to tweak the style, adjust the window preview size, the tile position, and adjust the animation duration or effect if you want a noticeable animation. There are plenty of options to customize and settle with something that feels right to you. The second one is an interesting extension, Compass Magic Lamp Effect. Just search for Compass the Like Magic Lamp and you should find it. Get it installed, considering you disabled the previous extension or removed it, and then watch it in action. It's more like the task switching animation effect that you get on Apple's macOS. Unlike the previous one, there's not a lot to customize, but you can adjust how the effect looks and the duration of the effect. And the last one. If you utilize workspaces more sincerely, you can use the workspace switcher extension. With this extension, you can do several tweaks to the default workspace switcher. It is accessible through the shortcut super plus page up or page down. You can do things like giving names to workspaces, displaying the active window title on each workspace and lots more. There are a few options to tweak here and there and you can control your experience accordingly. So how do you prefer to customize your GNOME task switching experience? Do you already use some of these extensions? Let us know your experience and what you prefer to customize in GNOME desktop in the comments down below.